Anyway, chaps, can I just say, there's no point doing whatever we've come here to do because the Aston is by far the best of the three. If you want the most expensive but the slowest, and it is, I yeah. can confirm this because I've brought some stuff with me. I believe my car is faster and more powerful. Yeah, Aston Martin, 167,851 pounds, uh, as opposed to 143, 149, and it's, uh, oh, it's the slowest, 191. Um, I think you'll find that Anne Widdicombe has more qualifications than Cheryl Cole, but... What's the point you're making? You wouldn't get it. Look, if... As, do you know Nietzsche? Yes. Nietzsche said if something can be defined, then it mm -hmm. loses its power. You look at these figures. Yes, 0 to 60, OK? 3.8 for the Ferrari, 4 for the Lamborghini, 4.3 for that. Hmm. Doesn't matter. You're oh. defining it here. You're defining that. It matters if you're comparing 0 to 60 times, doesn't it? Then it really does matter doesn't. which one is... Which yes. is on, the most beautiful? The Lamborghini. The Ferrari. Beautiful. Lamborghini. The Ferrari. The Lamborghini. You're not going to claim that that is beautiful. Depends. Also has the best engine. Of what relevance that, is that? That engine, it's, uh, it's the one that's uh, two Ford Mondeo engines now. Yes, it is. Yeah. Yes, it is. That's, that's right. So it's like when you pull up next to somebody in a V6 Mondeo, you can say, I've got two of those. Yes. Does it say together. twin Mondeo engines on the back? Wow, that's really got some... <laughs> Our highbrow debate was cut short by the arrival of a challenge.